Coach Schwab, before the duel today with Kent State, Coach, uh, you guys were undefeated last year as a duel team. Stark difference this year from last year in duels. What's been the difference besides losing three All-Americans, Coach? What, what's been the difference this year? Um, just, you know, winning tough matches, man. I, I, in any duel meet, you got to win tough matches. you got to find two ways to win the ones that could go either way. And, and uh, you know, a lot of our matches, we haven't been able to find to, a way to win those real tough, hard-fought matches. Um, and and, and that, that's going to... That's going to make it tough to, to, to beat anybody. You know, the other night we gave up some bonus points in some situations um, where I don't know if they necessarily earned them. We kind of gave them to them, you know. So those are the type of things that, that we didn't have last year. And, you know, we kind of had, had a little bit of an attitude, I think, when we walked out there. You know, having a guy like... Uh, Having a guy like Joe, and I don't like talking about last year, but having a guy like Joe and how he competed, it, it made a difference, you know, because he walked out there like I own the mat, and, you know, some of our other guys are like, okay, I'm going to walk out there like I own the mat too, and, and we got to have some of our, our younger guys start doing that too. You know, I own the mat, it's mine, and, and have that attitude when we step out there, and, and you know, we kind of still waiting for someone to, to, to take the torch and, and do that for our team this year. Blaze at uh, heavyweight is having a heck of a year. He's yep. top ten right now. Yep. Uh, he had a tech fall, I believe, Friday night. Yep. Is that is that what you're talking about? Respond and owning the mat like yeah, that? Yeah, for sure. I mean, he's he's probably you know as close as you can get, and uh, to have a heavyweight that is as offensive as he is and tries to score as many points and attacking and and uh, you know I think he had uh, we had a, a two dual meets. Uh, a couple weekends ago, I think he had 16 or 17 takedowns. You know, that's uh, that's that's pretty unheard of for for a heavyweight. But you know, he's confident. Uh, you know, he's had a, he's had a good streak going uh, and wrestling really well, scoring a lot of points. And you can see the confidence when he's out there. Uh, you know, uh, this guy beat him last year. You know, so um, I, I know that that he's excited for this match because he wants to show how far he's come in this last year. And and uh, you know, today's a great opportunity for him just to keep that role going. I think he's won you know, 12, 13 straight matches. And when you start doing that, you walk out there like like the guy that I'm talking about, like I do on the mat. And that's that's how he's competing right now. And that's fun to watch. Is that Schwab mob mentality? Is that, is that, uh, is that what we would call that? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can call it. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't, I, that's not a big, I'm not a big fan of that. But um, yeah, maybe more of the Panther train, you know, kind of get that momentum rolling. Get the, you know, when, when you get, when you're on the tracks and you're and you're moving forward and you got the momentum, it's hard to stop you. Um, and, and we got to get some guys to get some more momentum. And he's got a lot of momentum right now. Um, when, when you when you do that, it's it's like an avalanche, you know, that snowball turns into that avalanche. And we haven't been able to have that happen, you know, this year. Last year, you know, the first meet of the year against Wisconsin, we were kind of able to get that thing going. And, you know, today today's a new uh, another day, a chance for us to get it going and get it going for, for the, the last six weeks of the season because, you know, the, the – not that the dual meets don't matter, because I, I, I really bothers me when people say that dual meets. Oh, they don't matter. They don't matter. Um, they do matter because it's a chance to build our reputation. It's a chance to to build our resume for the national tournament. It's a, and it's a chance to to go out and show, you know, what kind of com competitors we are. But uh, the the big time of year is coming, though. You know, the MAC and the national tournament, and that's really what we're we've geared all season for. I mean, you do always. Um, so, you know, we we have three duels left uh, in the regular season, and we got to finish so strong. Um, you know, today, today's a great opportunity for us to, to see how we respond as a team and do we have some resiliency, you know, do we have some toughness. And, uh, you know, the thing that I talk to my team about today is emotion. Not, not just going through the motions, emotion, wrestling through that edge and having, having that fire, though. And you can, you can see it when a guy competes that way. Um, and when, you know, Peter's going to start us off today and that's how he needs to compete and then we've got to carry it up and down the lineup. Dylan Peters is right there. I mean, he's yeah. pinned Nathan Tomasello. He's had a, you know, he's had not, you know, this season last year he came, a lot of people didn't see him taking, you know, uh, sixth in the NCAA tournament last year. Uh, this season, is there any doubt in your mind he can't win the NCAA title? No, there's none. I mean, not, not in my mind. You know, we got to get it out of his mind, you know, that, that he is one of the best guys. Uh, you know, Waters, Waters handled him pretty good. Um, uh, but the thing is, is, is matches can change. You know, you've seen it. You know, we've all seen it week to week, uh, month to month, match to match, minute to minute, how things can change. You know, it's about getting guys in the right frame of mind. Um, and, and, you know, he's in the semifinals as a freshman last year. So you, you know that he can put himself there. Um, you just, we just got to sharpen a few things up. Uh, you know, there's some situations where, you know, guys are, guys are they're jumping out of that position now. You know, where, where, you know he, he pinned a lot of guys last year. I think 18 of them. He hasn't got quite as many this year because, you know, as soon as he gets there, guys are running out of there. But, you know, we, we can use that too. Um, but the thing about him is he's got a lot of tools, though, and he's got to unload them. And I've been saying, you know, he's got, you know, we don't got six shooters, man. You know, we got a, uh, I mean, what is it, Gatling gun that's got about, I mean, how many it's rounds? It's a barrel, yeah, 100. Yeah, barrel. You know, that's what we want. That's the kind of effort that I want to see in him. That's the kind of uh, the tax that I want to see out of him. You know, we want him to unload those guns when he goes out there because when he does, he's he's really fun to watch. And, and obviously you've seen him. He's a very powerful wrestler. Um, but the more that he can create, the better he's going to be. The more that he stands around and, and kind of looks and, 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 and plays the game, 
you know what, he, he, it could go either way. You know, so we want to make it so it goes his way every time, and so we're getting him to unload those guns. He scored, you know, 20 points the other night, and look forward to him scoring a lot of points today. Cooper, 165, Mac champ last year. What's Cooper got to do to make that jump? Like all those three All-Americans you lost, what's he got to do to make that jump this year? Um, just continue to open up his offense. Uh, you know, he's he, he's been dealing with some things this season, but you know, a lot of guys aren't 100 percent healthy. You know, but they still find ways to win, and 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 he's gotten better. You know, throughout the season, uh, and. And just being able to open up a little bit more, um, that's, a, that's the thing that I've seen. You know, when he hits attacks, he usually hits really strong, solid attack, keeps his head up, puts guys down. Um, you know, we just got to get him to get a few more of those um, and get, get, some, get some big wins. You know, he's, he's had a good run going, too. Uh, you know, he's won quite a few matches in a row. And like I so said, when you start, when you start winning matches, even if, even if they're not exactly how you want to win them, when you're still finding ways to win them, then, then you know that, hey, you know what, I, I can still find ways to win. And there's a lot of confidence in that. So, um, you know, he wrestled, a pretty good, he wrestled a good match the other night. Uh, against against high tower, um, controlled everything. You know, got off the bottom right away, which that guy's really good, really good on the mat. So, um, no, I just I'm just looking for him to, to open up a little bit more and, and score some more points and and uh, you know put himself on that stand. Wolfensberger's in a kind of a must win today as far as qualifying a spot. You know, he's got to beat small. Small's like 24th, 27th. Wolfensberger, he's a you know yeah, a 20 49. to yeah, 20 to th yeah we're at 40. That's well, 49. 40, no, yeah. But Wolfensberger's got, there. You go. Wolfensberger's got to beat the Palma today. Yeah, for sure. He's yeah, got to win that match. Yeah, today. Those yeah, they're they're important matches. I mean, every match is important. You know, especially when like said you're trying to build your resume. It's not just about getting to the national tournament. Well, obviously, we want to qualify spots and, and and punch your ticket that way. But um, it's just about getting on a roll and winning some matches. The the, the Mac at 49 is a tough weight. It's a very deep weight. Um, it may be the deepest one that we have. You know, if you look at it up and down. So uh, this is a big match for him today, and and uh, just to 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 get things moving in some momentum in his direction. You know, he lost the other night, and and uh, you know we got to be able to shut a few things down in De Palma. So uh, we'll see if he can get that done today. Who should I look for? You know, we've mentioned guys, but who who have I not talked about that that's a guy that I might see a breakout performance from tonight? Uh, you know, 41, Jake Hodges, he's a freshman, but he's been competing hard, man. He's been competing, you know, 41, and 41 in the MAC is a tough, it was a tough weight, too. Um, you know, but he, he's, he's showing signs that, okay, man, this guy, he's, he's starting to get, he's starting to break through. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming closer. And, you know, he's got a big match against Small today to really, to, to show, hey, okay, I, I, can, I can beat some of these guys that are really good and they're ranked. It doesn't matter. I can still go out and beat them and, and uh, not, just, not just hang with them, but I can beat them. All right, anyone else? Nah, we, you know, we've got to get, get these guys ready to scrap. So. All right, hey, thanks yeah, for the time, yeah, no